gate. Sorry, only First Life employees are allowed from this point. This is an emergency message from Mr. Almeida. Let Mr. Smith through. I repeat, let Mr. Smith through. Are you Mr. Smith? My sincere Straight. apologies, Mr. Smith. Please forgive me. But I'll tell you something, though. Even we don't know what goes on inside this building. Anyway, please come in. Signs of corrupt mint. Even their own employees don't even know what they're working for. That sounds pretty bad. Alright, so we're almost done with this chapter. No, you don't. No, you don't. Damn it, I'm gonna get hit again. I just know it. This is too easy. Oh, yes. I didn't get hit. <laughs> Alright. Let's see here. This is too easy. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> okay, on the right is the Harmon's room. Oh my god, no, I don't want to deal with you. No! I'm gonna get raped so bad. No! No, 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 no! <sighs> god, I hate those giant guys. I forget what they're called, but I really hate them. Yes, I will save Samantha. Coming up, coming up to about 46 minutes. I think we can do it in less than an hour. Let me see if I can defrag some blood. You still are an ugly fella. What the fuck are you looking at? Uh... Sorry, pal. But this is the moment. <laughs> I'm not a monster. It's only a mask. Just one. <laughs> Sorry, pal. Alright. I think that's good for now. Let's go take care of business. <laughs> no, I don't want to deal with you. You know, I find that weird because we just got... We just came back from a Harmon room, and there isn't a room there. That's kind of weird. But then again, Harmon room was also a little block of toilet. Cutscene. Yeah, cutscene, right when I open this. Ah, you made it. Well, how was your trip here? This city I've created is, is a paradise. Life here is perfectly autonomous, a model of peace. But our corporation, First Life Inc., <laughs> it doesn't exist, no sir. It just runs commercials. You see, people judge books by the covers. Oh, today's job is done. Ah oh, yes, you just might be able to meet today's lucky guy. Don't be alarmed. These are good citizens. No heaven smile. Our man, Clemens. Congratulations. Is it really me? 
Wow, I, I can't believe it! <laughs> Relax, Clements. Your job has just begun. Calm down, or you'll frighten Lady Luck away. You're, you're right, um... <laughs> Looks like he's on what should track. I <laughs> like I told you, first, you need to relax. Your job will be here any moment. Clements, this is yours. Go ahead, take a spin. Huh? This car? Is it really mine? Of course it is. Now take it and do what you want with it. It's really, really mine. Hop in and find out. Sick car. Literally. Clemens's job had a five million dollar price tag. This is what he gets to do. I would not want to be in a car that does that to you. Driving yourself to death. How long will Clemens last, or will he cross the finish line? If he makes oh God. it, he wins. So creepy. Bigger threats. So uh, I infected myself with all kinds of deadly viruses. I overcame them time after time, discovering vaccines and creating medicine all the way. I overcame all the symptoms. <sighs> but them smileys, whew, they're different. The risks involved are at another realm. I mean. It's flirting with fucking death itself. I, I, I want you to kill me. If I catch heaven's smile, you gotta kill Milk me. Milk tears. I heard you're the only one who can kill them. That's right. Shit's gonna go down. That is a huge ass syringe. I'm General Lynch from the United States Emergency Countermeasure Defense Department. I want to thank you for cooperating in the capture of Mr. Ulmeda. As you may know, this city is run by the military. This city remains a vital instrument for determining our country's safety standards. So I ask you, Forget what you witnessed that. here today. General, beginning countdown, sir. Aim. On your mark. Five, four, three, two, one. Mark. <laughs> I told you to kill me. Now. No, I'm going mad. I can't control this urge to kill. What are you going to do about it? Dan, get this over with once and for all. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Take cover! Hurry! Huh? <laughs> <laughs> cover? <laughs> Under what? <laughs> Am I affected by this? <laughs> yes! My dream is to defeat a bold black man. Naked. Let's not leave that out. <laughs> Naked man. Anything? What's in the wagon? Nothing. Okay. 
Well, uh, let's not go back this way. To the ambulance. He's actually pretty easy to uh, defeat. Uh, you just gotta shoot his afro. But don't get too close to him. Oh, he's gonna do this fire malaise thing on you. And it takes like a hell a lot of your, a whole bunch of your health. Okay, can't go that way. Basically, just circle around him until you can see his afro. <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> I did not mean to run into him! Alright. So, it's obviously a one hit kill. If it touches you. Or if you run into him like I did, stupidly. Don't make me say it again. I'm a crook. The fuck are you looking <laughs> You know, I think we're just gonna use someone else. I really don't want to revi revive him, and in the next chapter he's going to be revived anyway. So. Let's just stick with him. The next best man. Just go straight there. Oh, cool. Alright. Let's not screw up this one. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. He's just gonna be like right next to me. No, no, no! Oh my god, you gotta be freaking kidding me! Sorry, I probably killed the microphone there again. But damn it! Alright, I guess we will revive one of them. Don't make me say it again. I'm a clean. Okay, we did it, Garcian. <laughs> Whichever one I reach first will be the person that I'm going to be using. Alright, I could just risk it and use Garcian. I'm probably gonna die, so I'm not gonna do it. Hello, bag. Who's this? Look, I'm a queen. I can feel no remorse from seeing a dead body. To me, it's merely cold, rotting fish. Khan? Alright. Let's go with Khan then. <laughs> I don't know why I keep dying. I'm pressing the button to turn around, but... <laughs> it's not working! Why can't he just pick up both the bags? I don't understand it. Oh, 
All right. This time. <laughs> of course, he's got different hair colors, and you have to beat all of the hair colors that he has. <laughs> oh, wait, was that it? Oh, I guess it's because Kong was a high level. That's probably why he died. That was freaking easy. It took a lot less effort than I thought. I had to die two times, but... <laughs> what happened to Mr. Olmeda? How can you be okay huh? after that uh, freaking uh, blast of a car ride you just this had? This blood. I probably faint as soon it as I fall. It tastes out. like Mr. Olmeda's. So, he's dead, isn't he? <laughs> You've tasted human blood before. I've always had a sixth sense. If I had only attained Mr. Olmeda's level earlier. Clements, you're in control of things now. Walk down the path of life. Don't succumb to weakness. Take the big risks. Rest assured, Master Olmeda. I will watch over this town. Our way of life stands eternal. May peace rest with our great Olmeda. Our Messiah. I would not like to live in that town. Well, there we go. We've completed Cloud Man. Yay. And we just hit the one hour mark. So it's perfect timing. Let's see. <laughs> 54? Not too bad. Not too bad. Day when he stopped smiling <laughs> and he remained his smile. Blah. Encounter. All right, we'll do that next session, but I'm gonna call it quits for tonight, cause I'm sleepy and I gotta get up early for mo for work tomorrow. So I'm gonna save it here and I'ma say my goodbyes. Hope you guys enjoyed this uh this session, and uh, I'll try to get the rest up as fast as I can. Thanks for watching!